What is up everyone? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make an iron golem farm. We have one right here, but I think I'm going to like try to make a more effective one. And we got Floral to help us. He's my island member. So in a little bit, I'm going to hop on a call with him and he's going to help us out. But for now, I have this admin crate that I'm going to be opening. Obviously, we got to open some crates in the server. Let's open this crate real quick. I think we can get like nine rewards. Let's open like three at a time. Okay, so from the first ones, we're going to get, we got some money pouches, 500k experience. That's actually kind of great. Then we got 16 partner keys. That's a really good one because partner keys can give a lot of good rewards okay let's open another three right here okay so we're going to get four money pouches an enchanter g kit gem and then we got two legendary trunk collectors that's decent and then from the last one i'm gonna go for this these three down here hopefully we get some more keys or some mob coins would be nice too okay so we got 10k mob coins and admin sword i think that's probably one of the better swords on the server and then we got some more money pouches and we can go for the final reward hopefully we get some good i really want to try to get like maybe a rank or maybe some key keys okay we got a keys g kit actually that's actually pretty decent so we're gonna open these money pouches real quick we got uh about a few million dollars from that not really something huge and then we got a godly kit it's the enchanter kit and i get unlimited access to the godly kit that's the enchanted one so i'm gonna right click this and we can confirm that so now we have that kit and we also have the keys kit i'm gonna redeem the keys kit we have some more money pouches that we can redeem and we got a god sword i don't know if this is better it has better sharpness and better on breaking but this one has looting and also has fire aspects so so I think you can probably upgrade this though. So the admin sword does have a lot better sharpness though. So it's a lot better. And then we got two legendary eye chests. That's pretty decent. And then I'm going to use this 500,000 uh, XP. So here we go. We got all the way up to level 539. That's actually pretty decent. We're up to 1.2 million XP. Also from our cactus farm over here, it actually just got nerfed. But before it got nerfed, we got 3 billion from it. So it was very OP. It's still kind of OP, but they just nerfed it by like half. So it's not as overpowered as it was before. Also, we got our past progress off camera a little bit. We're now on tier three and i'm working towards these tier four quests i feel like the place 10 villager spawner is easy because i can just place 10 and then get them back like i can have one villager spawner and i think i can get that quest done just by like placing it and then like getting them back and placing it again over and over and we got the break 4,000 melons done now we need to kill five enemies place 10 villager spawner which i'm gonna go do this real quick actually and then we can break 2500 emerald ore which will take a little bit of time but after all those will be at tier four which will be a really good mine right now i'm at the emerald mine i'm getting very close to the obsidian mine which is actually very overpowered but for now i'm just gonna go into the video i'm gonna show you guys how to make an op like uh, iron golem farm iron golem farms can be one of the best ways to get money right now especially if you have thousands of iron golem spawners and it can get very good also i'm gonna check the mob coin shop i'm gonna see if there's anything that i can get let's see what the dailies have there's pet candy enchant remover we got some orbs i don't really know what these are all for we got fly unlock that's pretty good pretty much all kind of bad stuff a little bit but i'm gonna go check out my g kits before we get into the video so we have the enchanter g kit and then we have the keys g kit so we got three hydro keys five cracking keys and three partner keys from the keys g kit i think it restarts yeah every three days it resets we also have the enchanter g kit we're going to be redeeming what we got 16 common and six legendary enchants we got two item name tags and some enchant removers enchant organizer i don't really know what that does but i'm gonna just go ahead and put that in one of my pvs and i'm gonna open all those keys now so we have three hydro keys we're gonna open these first i think these are probably one of the worst ones so we got 50,000, and we got some xp as well and we're gonna open this cracking keys these are pretty decent actually so we're gonna spam open those oh my we just got some iron golem spawners which is nice we got a chronos kit chronos kit's actually good for my island members okay now we have 19 partner keys i'm gonna cl clear out my inventory a little bit first and then i'm gonna open these partner keys okay now we have 19 partner keys i'm just gonna middle click these i'm gonna spam them all okay so we got actually i got a zephyr rank that's the second top rank so uh shout out to my island member that's gonna be getting that we got a experience booster two partner keys we are getting a bunch of money oh! Uh, shout out to whoever just followed me on Twitch. Okay, we got a bunch of mob coins, some global boosters. We're, we're pretty much just getting a ton of mob coins, and we got another rank, a Zephyr rank again. I'm gonna use both these XP balls, see how high we can get. Okay, we got 550, we're at almost a 1.3 million. So pretty much that concludes it for the intro. I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make the Iron Golem farm now. So I'm just gonna cut back to whenever I'm with my friend in the call. Okay, so we're back. I got in a call with my friend. Hello, hello, hello. So he's gonna be guiding us on this build today, because like I don't really know how to build. I I've built some in the past, but like like not in like probably a year or something but he's gonna be explaining like we're gonna build it first and then he's gonna like explain like how you do it and then also another good tip you can do f3 plus g and you can see the chunk so this is like how you're supposed to do it to make sure you're building inside the chunk and i think it's like 16 by 16 is what a chunk is and then you have to have like waters on each side but whenever we're done i'll like show you guys what it looks like and he's gonna explain more but for now i'm gonna just do like a time lapse of me like building it actually it's gonna be probably fluid building it i'll probably help but we're just gonna build it for now and then i'm coming back whenever we're done so I'll see you guys then
Okay, so now all we have to do is place this lava and then we'll be done. We have to place the iron golem spawners and we'll be done actually. But for now, this is what it looks like. So essentially, we just place soul sand on all the sides and it goes out five blocks. Well, actually, it goes out six blocks. And then we have to place water on each side and lava in the middle. So the iron golems will spawn up here, fall into the lava. And their items that they collect will be going into like a chunk collector. And hopefully, we can get like hundreds, maybe even like up to a thousand iron golem spawners at some time. Because I know the top island has thousands of them. So hopefully, we can get up to that close to that number obviously it's going to be hard to get number one so hopefully we can get close to it at least so anything else we have to do for this floral um we just have to do some more pillars and then after we can place igs and it will be working all right sounds good do we have any igs we can buy some we have a few igs and then we can buy some more this one is more effective than that one right yeah so this one should make more okay so there's the iron golem spawners we have 168 iron golem spawners the spawns like hundreds in this stack right now we only have 168 hopefully we can get some more by next episode i don't think there's a stack limit is there a stack limit for world i think there's a stack limit 2500 yeah basically the stack limit is unlimited because because that's a big number but hopefully we can get this like upgraded a lot maybe we'll have like 500 on each base like sometime sometimes this season maybe very soon hopefully also we got some big grinders on this island like floral and another person named axe big grinders so we got a good possibility to get like top 10 maybe even top 5 or something like that just from that one iron golem spot on. I got like an entire inventory almost of iron ingots and sell all. We got a hundred thousand for selling all of that, so it's pretty decent. Now I, I want to show you guys another way we can make money, which is this cactus farm over here. It goes up all the way to the sky, and we can go down and check out how much it makes. Okay, so right now do we have some people AFKing it right now, but this one has twelve million. It's getting like let's see, it's this one's getting just a few thousand every second. I know there's some other ones the, like this one's giving like two thousand every second. There's one that gives like a ton. Okay, this one gives around two thousand every second. Let me try to find one this one right here has 50 million this one has 80 million this one has 80 million so i think this one and this one over here these are the superior ones so these ones get like the most money and it gets four times that actually because we have a four times sell wand and we can use global boosters so we're getting about like up to like 10 almost 10 times what that actually says because if we use our sell wand plus our boosters and global boosters it will give a lot more than it actually says and overnight it'll probably give like a ton of billions so this is one of the other ways to get a lot of money also i'm going to show you guys this other grinder over here this one is just like a grinder for like killing these mobs this is for getting xp and like battle quest stun also i forgot to mention there's a pet called the money pet i don't know if it works right now but if it works it gives like a boost on your money so it'll give you even more money than before so just know that this iron golem farm is going to get a lot more op okay so we actually just placed a chunk collector for this so all the money is going to go into this chunk collector whenever the iron golems die so it's a very efficient way of getting money this one is a lot more efficient because the soul sand can make the zombies go slower making them have bigger stacks and getting more money so literally just from that one iron golem dying we literally got 500,000 almost already so overnight that can give probably like 50 million or something like that it's not as good as the cactus farm but it's still decent and obviously this melon farm was just for the battle pass quest but the cactus farm is very good so that's about it for this video i'll see you guys in the next video some more progress so thank you guys so much for watching and goodbye